We're back here at 625 in our Together Inspired series. It's a new take on bedtime stories. Tabitha is explaining how a local teacher is using technology to provide every child a story before they nod off. That's right. You remember being read to as oh, a yeah. child and reading to your sons. I love it. And it's so crucial, but mm -hmm. this teacher found out when she asked her students if they were being read to at night that many of them weren't. So she wanted to change that. Take a look. One in front of us. I'm at a dentist's office, and it happens to be our special guest reader, Dr. Gerard. This is how it starts a friendly introduction, followed by a fun tale. One morning, Sister Bear woke up in the same old bed, in the same old pajamas and yawn the same old yawn. Dr. Tanvir Riar is reading the Bernstein Bears go to the dentist for Miss Chaudhry's Champions, a YouTube page dedicated to sharing bedtime stories with young people who may not have someone at home to read to them. Oh, brother had a cavity. I teach third grade and I was um, teaching math and a lot of parents had questions about math homework and so I started making YouTube videos to reach the parents so they could understand what, we were, what was being done in school. Um, soon after that I had attended some um, different conferences for reading and teaching students how to read and I asked my kiddos um, if they were being read to at night and I think like two kids raised their hands. Miss Chaudhry decided to change that, expanding her YouTube channel to include bedtime stories. I said, okay, you know what, I want to read to you guys and how can I read to you guys? So I couldn't go into their homes and read to each kid. I said, how many of you have tablets? How many have phones? And they all have tablets, they have phones, they have laptops. They have ways to get online. So it's like, okay, well then I'll meet you there. A final rinse, and brother jumped down as good as new. Your turn, he shouted. Miss Chaudhry invites guest readers to join her in the adventure. Every Friday, she introduces viewers to a new storyteller and a new story. Honestly, when I heard about it, I thought it was an awesome idea. In a world where everything's on the iPad, it's always very cool to pull out a book. And if we can do that interactively for kids, it's, it's just a great way to kind of incorporate the technology and give them access to a cool new adventure every week. I'm trying to love spiders, but it isn't easy. I couldn't help but join in. I decided to read I'm Trying to Love Spiders by Bethany Barton. Let's see. I think it's working. Ah! It's moving! Okay. Needless to say, oh I had a lot of fun. Stop right here! Do you see it? Right there! Hey, what's that little spider doing? Wow, thanks little guy. That was really impressive. He ate all the bugs. Did you see that? All the bugs are gone. Spider present for you. A box of flies for that spider. I love it. It's so great. And Miss Chaudhry also provides stories in several languages, so she so really wants wonderful. no barriers to young people. If they if they want a story read to them at night, they can just get on That's Chaudhry's so Champions sweet. on YouTube. And she's looking for readers. So if you'd like to read, I know we aired this story once today. People have already uh, sent me a text saying they That's want to so read. Cool. We love that. Yeah, I'll, I'll uh, give you that information on KGET.com.